this is the dashboard for the CAP TD520 display. There is a system status that shows GPS receivers, machine radios, ECMs, all the components that make the system work. We have attachments that tell you which bucket is attached with how many teeth. There's also job site setup which shows which project is loaded, what mode is selected, in this case design, and not depth and slope. The licenses panel tells you all the licenses that are activated on the machine. If one of the boxes on the dashboard were red, it would indicate something is not right on the machine and the start button would be grayed out. With all boxes good, the start button is yellow, meaning it's ready. Click Start to begin. The job site is loaded and there are several indicators to point out. Cut fill to the left, there's a cut fill to the right, and a cut fill to the center. There is a bucket focus indicator at the bottom of the screen that can be changed to monitor different points of the bucket. The name of the design is listed at the top of the screen. There is a horizontal offset value and a vertical offset value. At the bottom it says there needs to be a 4.75 foot cut and there are light bar indicators on the side to show how close the bucket is to the cut. The entire screen is touch screen which means you can pinch the image to zoom in and out to see a better profile of the ditch. You can also swipe over to have an alternate view, side profile, cross section, and plan view. Swipe again and you get a three-dimensional plan view to get a better view of the site. Notice the dotted line around the machine that's the total reach of the machine. Swipe again and you return back to the desired view. Back to the working screen. Notice the offset. You can set an offset if needed. In this case, we'll set a 5 tenths of a foot offset. Now the dotted line represents the original design plan, where the solid line represents this negative offset design. Now, we will dig down to grade. Notice, as the bucket gets closer to grade, the side indicators turn green. In the lower right-hand corner of the display, you'll notice the 3D with Assist Autos indicator is on. With the autos turned off, we'll cut the side of the trench and we'll use the teeth to knock off some material. All this time, the display shows the position of the bucket in real time to the desired 3D site plan. All indicators will turn green once target grade is achieved. For more information, consult your operation and maintenance manual or contact your local CAT dealer.